safety car and the Rene Binder, right Vlad Lomko green. and no the rest. Before the line, no overtaking before the line, but finally, after such a long wait, the final round of the European Le Mans series is green, green, green. And some very smart moves there from Phil Hansen and Manuel Maldonado to get well out of the spray kicked up from Paul Lafargue so at least they could see the breaking point. And Hansen's going to waste absolutely no time at all in charging down the inside of the Frenchman to take the race lead. He's gold, remember, compared to Paul Lafargue being silver. And this was all part of the game plan of nominating Phil Hansen as the starting driver for United Autosports. They wanted to get the lead and they ideally wanted to get a decent gap before those first pit stops in LMP2. So great stuff at the restart. It's order restored, three wide and off to the side. Paul Lafarge being eaten up here by the competition behind. He's dropping back and he's down now to honest that fifth place. Phil Hansen away and clear ahead of the Duquesne team car of Rennie Binder. Oh, trouble for the 37 car. That'll be Alexandra Kwani, I think. He's been turned around, drops down through the LMP3 order as he tries to recover at turn five. That is, I think, going to be a problem area, still standing water there. Aboard here with Rennie Binder, up to second place, behind Phil Hansen, Manuel Maldonado up to third, Kiffin Simpson fourth, and there's trouble for... That's the replay. So that's what happened. Phil Hansen everybody. Ran, ran into the turn five far, far too deep. And the big loser there was Paul Lafargue, uh, losing three positions. Quite a melee in LMP3 as well. And now the du Duquesne car with a bizarre line through turn 13 for its starting driver, Rene Binder. So these are testing times to find out precisely where any of the grip is. Phil Hansen with a moment, his first run into the hairpin, at least he controlled that. But they, you're right, three abreast for a time. And Rene Binder has lost one, two, three, four places at least. Make that five now as he slips back to seventh position. Alexander Kwani is back up to speed. It appears to be an incident involving himself and Hurst Felbermeyer that caused that, but he's dropped all the way down the 37 car in 37th place. 